So this question is a diagram question. We know that because of the table that is provided. So let's just take a look at this table. The title of the table here, or the heading, says number of contestants by score and day. So it looks like our days are the rows, right? Day one through three. And then our scores, right? Five out of five, four out of five. All of our scores are the columns. And then we have a total column and a total row. So the question says the same 20 contestants on each of three days answered five questions in order to win a prize. Each contestant received one point for each correct answer. The number of contestants receiving a given score on each day is shown in the table. So what does that mean? That means, for instance, this number five right here means that there were five contestants on day two who scored three out of five points, and we were told that every question correctly, every question answered correct was a single point, right? So each of those five contestants scored three points on that particular day. Um, that's called the pinpoint method, where you just circle a number on a table and then interpret what that number means. It's very helpful. So question 37 says, what was the mean score of the contestants on day one? Okay, well, let's figure out First of all, what were the scores for the contestants on day one? So day one, obviously, is our first row here. I'm not going to need to look at the total there. So what does this first two here for day one mean? Well, it means that there were two contestants that scored five out of five, which means I have two scores of five. And then the three here means that there were three contestants that scored four out of five. So I'd have three contestants that scored a four. And then I'd have, uh, oh, that's wrong. Let me get rid of that. That actually, that is actually saying that there were three contestants that scored a four. Oh, so that was that was right. My fault. And then uh, there are four contestants that scored a three. That's why I got confused. So one, two, three, four contestants that scored a three. And then this six here represents the fact that there were six contestants that scored a two. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And uh, next, our two here is that there were two contestants that scored one. So one and one. And then there were three contestants that scored zero. So one, two, three. So we're looking for the mean. The mean just means we're adding up all of our values here and then dividing by the number of scores or the number of values that we have. And because this is the calculator section, I can just calculate this. I'm going to just do this a little bit differently so you can see by hand. So this is 10, 4 times 3 is 12, 3 times 4 is 12, 2 times 6 is 12. Of course, 1 plus 1 is 2, and of course, all this is 0. Uh, 12 plus 12 is 24, 24 plus 10, right? So those two, I get 34. 34 plus, 30, 34 plus 12, I'm sorry, is equal to 46, and then plus the 2 here is equal to 48, and then of course 48 plus zero is um, just still 48. And we should have 20 contestants. So let me just make sure I did that correctly. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So divide that by 20. Then I go to my calculator and just do 48 divide it by 20, and what I get is 2.4 as the answer.